Got a goal and you just can't hit it? Well, fill up here and we'll help you get it. Learn the goal achievement success system here on Goal Getting Podcast and put some gas in your goals to power you to the finish line. Let's go, friends. Rev up your engines and let's take off for success. Hello and welcome to the show. This is your host, Tony Woodall with Goal Getting Podcast. I want to thank you for showing up today and listening to our show. I'm going to talk a little bit about a great quote from Nadia Comaneci. I don't run away from a challenge because I'm afraid. Instead, I run towards it because the only way to escape fear is to trample it beneath your foot. I don't run away from a challenge because I'm afraid. Instead, I run towards it because the only way to escape fear is to trample it beneath your foot. You know, when I was growing up, I had the biggest crush on Nadia Comaneci. Nadia was the Romanian gymnast in the 1976 Olympics that stunned the world with her uneven parallel bar performance. She was the first gymnast to score a perfect 10. Well, I was about 18 at the time, and I just thought she was cute. I was amazed at what she could do. She was amazing, and she was cute. So she, like many top athletes, don't run from challenges. They embrace the challenge, and as Nadia said, they run towards them. That is what makes them exceptional athletes. When most of us would give up, would whine and complain, they get out and try to find the way to win. How do you handle your challenges? What do you do to overcome the obstacles and struggles you have to go through? Do you give up? Do you stop trying to achieve your goals? Are you a winner or a whiner? I remember when I started my martial arts training in ninjutsu, we had a t-shirt you could get that said, there is no H in winning. So don't whine about the circumstances. Don't complain about what you can't change. Find what you can do and start doing it. If you have a goal that you want to achieve, something that you want to be or do, figure out what it is that you are going to have to do to achieve the goal. That's exactly what I mean when I say do. Achieving your goal requires action, folks. It requires you to do something. My goal this year is to get to 185 pounds. I have certain tasks that I must do to achieve that goal. I can't just sit around watching TV, surfing the web, and eating crappy foods. I have to take the action steps needed to burn the calories or eliminate the intake of calories to be able to lose the weight. I have to be smart about it and eat the right foods. That doesn't mean just lettuce and veggies. There are proteins and fats that I have to eat. There are certain foods, of course, that I should avoid eating. There are tasks that I must do to burn calories. We could call it exercise, but that, well, crap, that sounds like work. Nobody likes to work that much, so we need to find something that requires movement that you love to do. If you like to walk, then walk. I love walking. I go four or five, sometimes ten miles on a week and walk that I do just because I enjoy being out in the nature, you know, walking on trails or walking the streets even, just, you know, seeing all the great things around and just enjoying the weather. If you like to dance, well, go out and dance. You know, I like to dance, and, you know, I've thought about going outside and just dancing when nobody can see me and I don't really care if they do but go out and dance because you enjoy it if you like to play softball or football or soccer or tennis then go out as often as you can and play which reminds me of being a kid you remember being a kid and your friends came over and asked if you wanted to come out and play and you used to run out of the house down the street go hang out in the woods climb trees ride bikes you know for miles and this wasn't exercise to me this was play this was fun So what you have to do is go out and find something fun and active and do it. And if you have a goal and you have struggles or challenges, run toward them, fix them, fight them, beat them. Do what it takes to overcome those obstacles, those challenges. Just don't run from them. Face the fears, fight the urge to quit, and keep moving forward. Go out today and do like Nadia. Trample the fears beneath your feet. I do want to thank you. This is Tony Woodall, your host with Goal Getting Podcast. Welcome back to the show. We're going to be doing some quotes and some great motivational talks here as I start building Goal Getting Podcast back up. Taking a short time trying to get myself back in mental shape as well as physical, and I am 
going to keep working at it, and I want you to as well. So come on back and listen to the show. Let me know what you think in our comment section. You can go to goalgettingpodcast.com, S2, excuse me, that's goalgettingpodcast.com forward slash S2E42. This is episode 42 of season two, so go to goalgettingpodcast.com forward slash S2E42. The only way to escape fear, folks, is to trample it so thank you so much go out and make today a great day and we'll see you next time on Gold Getting Podcast